For this tutorial, I'll be using the Dolphin emulator on a Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Ultra running Android 13. First, we'll download Project Plus from the official site. Choose the Dolphin for Windows version and save it on a separate computer. Next, we'll create a new folder in your Samsung device. I'm going to name this folder Games of Our Galaxy. After we've created this folder, let's plug in our Galaxy device to our computer so that we can place three items inside. Drag the Project Plus offline launcher from this location into your newly created folder. Do the same for your sd.raw file, which can be found here. Lastly, drag your Super Smash Bros. Brawl ISO into the same folder. Finally, we'll download the Dolphin emulator. We'll do that by navigating to the Play Store, searching for Dolphin, and downloading the software. Before we start up the emulator, I'm going to go ahead and plug in a GameCube controller using a Mayflash adapter and a USB-C adapter. However, most Bluetooth or USB controllers will work. Now we'll start up Dolphin. Next, click Add Games on the bottom right corner, navigate to the folder we created, and use this folder. Back on the Dolphin main menu, press the gear icon. Navigate to Config, then Paths. Toggle on Search Subfolders for Game Files. Doing this allows us to further organize the games folder while Dolphin will still be able to find your game content. Below the option we just toggled, click Default ISO and select your Super Smash Bros. Brawl ISO in your games folder. Finally, let's exit out of Paths, which takes us back to the config window. Select Wii in the Options list and scroll down to SD Card Path. Navigate to your SD.raw file and select it. If you're also using the Mayflash adapter, go back to Settings, click GameCube Input, and select GameCube Adapter. Lastly, be sure to click OK on the window that pops up. For the moment of truth, let's go back to the main Dolphin window and select the folder icon. You should see the Project Plus online launcher file. Double click on it and you're good to go. If this tutorial helped, then be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching.